loud. I don't know, because this is a this is a bit of a test, I guess. Uh, you know, a few people have brought up this idea to me recently that I should try vlogging, I guess it's called, and uh, talking a little bit about my life and about my opinions on things and, and that sort of stuff. Um, anyway, I've been, uh, I've been on the road for the last week touring around, drive from Vancouver out to Calgary and up to Edmonton and back to Calgary and I'm headed back to Vancouver now. I'm driving through uh, forest fires so the air all around is really smoky and thick and uh, and it's you know it's hard to see far distances but it's starting to rain so hopefully you know, hopefully this rain is a good thing and it's not going to turn into, um, you know, any kind of lightning or anything like that that might make it worse. Uh, because it's been, uh, the fires have been really bad for the last two weeks or so. But anyway, I guess like I just wanted to talk about mostly just the road and, and how it makes me feel and How it brings me answers to, to questions I never knew I had. Uh, I think it's good every once in a while to, to you know to take stock and to consciously uh, make an effort to spend time by myself uh, for an extended period of time. You know, even a week. A week's not a long time, but and I haven't been entirely by myself the whole week because I've been doing like some photo shoots and stuff oh, which is nice it's all strangers too so there's something different about being around strangers and, and how how we, we represent ourselves to people that we don't know yet whether or not we choose to just be raw and open or, or whether or not you know we put on some sort of a mask for, for business purposes or, or for networking or, or for some, some kind of a personal gain or just because we're afraid. Sometimes we're just afraid of how, <clears throat> sometimes we're afraid of how we might be judged or, or perceived. And I think that that's what this whole time in my life right now is about. It's about facing fear. It's about, it's a real, it's about realizing that the only way to grow is to face my fears every day, all day, emotionally, spiritually, career fears, everything. It's the only way to grow. And uh, it hurts. It fucking hurts deep inside sometimes. Like, nothing else hurts, you know? But um, the more of that pain that I'm able to fight through, the more I'm enjoying my life. The more I'm, I'm reaping the benefits of that work, and that's what it is. It's, it's fucking work, man. It's fucking work. Let me tell you. But you gotta do it. You gotta fucking fight through. You gotta fight through it every day, every fucking day. You fight through. And some days are amazing. They're beautiful. They're great days have those gifts. Some days just aren't. Some days are fucking tough. You know? And maybe you lose the battle, but don't lose the war. And, uh, and that's what the road does. The road, you know, makes me think like, hey, what, what would I do this week if I found out I had a terminal illness, for example? I got one week to live. What would I do? Who would I spend it with? Who would I spend that time with? what I do with that person. Is there anybody I would call? Is there anything I would say? Is there something I haven't written? Is there some some fucking skill I haven't, you know, improved upon or taken advantage of or somewhere I, I, I want to see in the world? Some 
kind of bucket list, you know. Um, so yeah, I'm on my way back home, and uh, I think I've answered a couple of my questions, a couple of my hard questions. Um, I think I have a, I think I have a better idea of some of the things that I need to do, some of the things I need to get done, some of the things I got to scratch off that list, you know. And I have a better idea of who I am and what I want, and also just that you know that I like my life. I was thinking about that. I was thinking about the fact that you know what I like what I do. That's a fucking blessing. That's a blessing. And yeah, I worked for it. Yeah, I set it up. It's not luck. It's hard work every day. But I like it. I like how the gym makes me feel. I like the networking with people and the, and the creative ventures that I'm involved in. And I, I like sitting down in the morning and, and, and writing. And I like, I like it. I like fucking around on Facebook, you know, get people talking, doing stupid shit, sharing my whatever journey, I guess. Anyway, the road and the answers, and they're out here. And I'm Canadian, and so I live in one of the largest countries in the world. I have the ability to get in the car and drive you know I could drive for a week and not run out of land and not see the same place twice you know today I've got 12 hours of driving to do and that's nothing in this country so yeah I'm blessed and uh, anyway I just wanted to share that with you and uh, I don't know take it for what it's worth have a good day.